and friends, we are going to be making our O for octopus. Octopus has an eight legs. So here's our page of legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have eight, eight legs that we've got to cut out. So we've got our work to do today. So these are, this is our big letter O. We've got our eyeballs for our octopus and we've got our octopus legs. So let's get started. Yeah. I'm going to start by taking my scissors and they're supposed, this is supposed to be finished right here, but it didn't copy very well. So Mrs. M is just gonna, we're going to just going to cut along that. This is what I'm going to do. This isn't a tricky cutting maneuver. My friends, this is advanced cutting, but you don't have to do it this way. You can do it. However is easiest for you. However, makes the most sense to you. I'm just cutting off this bottom. So then all I have to do is straight line cutting, which is my favorite. It's so easy, right? So now that we've got the lumpies cut off, we get straight line cuts the rest of the time. See? One, two, three, four, five, six snips. Move these out of the way. Six snips. So that's all we need. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six. <gasps> one, two, three, four, five, six. And last one. One, two, three, four, five, six. <gasps> now we have our octopus legs. And again, Mrs. M forgot to color it before we cut it out. <laughs> Story of my life. So what we're gonna do, you guys can color these octopus legs. I recommend you color it first. <laughs> Color it whatever design you want. Since I already cut it out, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna give, you know how octopus, they have like little suction cups on their little leggies. So I'm gonna give him some suction cup um, suckers on his legs. And then we're just gonna glue them on because Mrs. M did a bad job of doing this. So how many circles should I do? Let's see, let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, how perfect. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 And last one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Fantastic. Oh, while I have my marker, I'm going to go over here and color the big letter O. I'm going to color it pink because I don't know why octopus. I don't know. I feel like octopus have a lot of different colors and it's just going to match his little suckers on his feet. So I'm going to, I'm going to color it this way. Again, this is Emma's doing it so messy. I'm such a messy colorer. When we make these videos in real life, I'm much nicer and neater. But again, I don't need to see Mrs. M color. So I'm going to just scribble it up, guys. I'm so sorry. Please color it nice and neat. Make it way more beautiful, but we don't need a 10-minute video of Mrs. M coloring a, a letter O pink. You guys will make it so beautiful. I'm so excited to see your beauteous creations. All right. O, letter O. So next thing we're going to do is we're going to cut out our O. Boop, boop. This one should be a little bit easy because we just spin the paper, right? Grab the paper, spin it around, cut open and shut, chompa chomp, chompa chompa chompa, right? All right, chomp it all the way around. Got our O. I'm actually going to leave the inside, which you can do, or you can take it out. Now I'm going to cut out the eyeballs. Oops, you might want to cut further around the outside because then you have more of the black line. Boink. One eyeball for this guy. You know why I'm going to leave the O or the inside of the O? Because last time I did it, it looked like a big octopus nose. And I kind of liked that. Mrs. M likes to do these crafts because we are in preschool. So we get to do them however our heart desires. I want you to be creative and make it a really cool octopus. Oh, yeah. Look at this guy. Ah, oh, what a cutie. I should have left that eye border a little bit thicker, but that's all right. Here we are. One eyeball for the octopus. Two eyeballs for the octopus. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. So 
What I'm next going to do, I'm going to actually fix my octo eye because it's bugging me. So I'm going to give it a little bit of a thicker around because the other one has it and I don't like it when it's uneven. <laughs> then I'm going to take my black and I'm going to give him a little, give her a little smile right here. I decided this is a lady octopus. So we're going to give her a little smirk, little smirk adieu. And then I'm going to take my glue stick and I'm just going to go like this because we got to get all those legs on. So we're just going to go like that. And then I'm going to go, where's my sticky glue? One, one, two, three, four. And they're going to fit five, six. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I got to scooch them. There you go. Now we're going to get it. Seven, eight. Lay them straight. Beaut. Oh, geez. Now I'm covered in glue and they're sticking to me. Bum, ba, -bum. We've got our octopus. I'm loving it. You guys, show me your amazing creations because I can't wait to see them. I can't wait to see them, guys. Oh, my glue, my, now I'm making a mess. It's a whole thing, guys. You're doing great. Love it. Keep up the good work.